Today is Thursday, November 23rd, Thanksgiving. And I've been wondering about all the things I'm thankful for. And now, a word from our title sponsor. Are all financial advisors fiduciaries? Fewer than you think, not knowing could reduce your lifestyle. Hi, I'm Mitch Kramer, founder and CEO of Fluent Financial. A fiduciary is a regulatory term to reduce conflicts of interest in wealth management. A fiduciary always works in your best interest. A non-fiduciary advisor might put their compensation or company ahead of yours. At Fluent Financial, we are certified financial planners acting as fiduciary advisors. To learn more, go to FluentFinancial.com or Fluent Financial's YouTube channel. Today, we'll all in America gather around our Thanksgiving tables, and the question will come up. Let's go around the room and say something you're thankful for. Well, that's what I'm going to do. First of all, I'm thankful for my family, the family I've found through Mary. I have no one left on earth who's part of my family. But there's nothing quite like the total acceptance that comes with being a close family. Next, I'm thankful for sports, for the entertainment, the intensity, the unpredictability, the joy that sports has brought me for more than seven decades now. I'm thankful for the DFW area, so warm and welcome and friendly over the years to me, and thankful for those thousands and thousands of people who listened over the years on the radio, most of whom I will never cross paths with in my life. With seasonings, you seem to need so many, and then they just sit in your spice cabinet month after month. That is not true of goodness steak seasonings. Now, I know the name steak suggests that it's very good on steak which it is. But goodness, steak season is so versatile. Use it on veggies, burgers, soups, even popcorn. Get it by going to the website, bringthetasty.com. That's bringthetasty.com. Goodness, this seasoning is good. I'm thankful for the people who gave me starts in life. Tracking all the way back to the early 70s, when Eddie Barker hired me to join CBS TV in Dallas with no previous television experience. That's ridiculous. That's just ridiculous. I'm thankful to Tony Garrett at KERA Radio, their news director at the time, who asked me if I'd like to come over and do a one-hour sports talk show on Friday morning on KERA. He paid me the princely sum of $15. And looking back, I was probably overpaid. I'm thankful to Home Sports Entertainment and to ESPN, who gave me a chance to broadcast as an analyst 15 years of Major League Baseball six years of analysis for the Dallas Mavericks, hundreds and hundreds of college football and college basketball games. And at ESPN, I got to go and work the Kentucky Derby. And I worked college game day for them and worked on Sports Center for them. I'm thankful, so thankful for my friend, and Radio General Manager Dan Bennett, who 38 years ago took a chance on the first all-sports morning talk show in the country. And then I'm also thankful that Dan sat and listened to this wacko idea of being the first to ever broadcast the entire draft of the NFL, all of it. First pick to last. And he said, well, if you think it'll work. 
What's damaged your roof? Hail, wind, water, maybe just age. Oh, Hail Roofing is where to turn. That's O with two H's, Hail. They've provided the best options, advice, and solutions, be it residential or commercial, for more than a decade now. Trust O Hail to restore your property expertly. Do you have roof problems? Your best answer is at O with two H's, Hail.com. That's O Hail.com. I'm thankful for travel. For the many, many, many things I've been able to see in the world. Some of them in places that barely make it on the maps. And God willing, many, many more to come. I'm thankful for friends. So many good friends. Scattered all around the world. Some friends I've lost this year. Mark Friedman. Walt Garrison, and others. And I'm thankful for the best friend in my life, my wife, Mary. Finally, I'm thankful to the Lord for this day, because we are never guaranteed any more days in the future. God has seen me through two major auto accidents, three bladder cancer procedures, that's what they're calling surgery now. And I would estimate about another 20 surgeries in my life. And tomorrow morning, I'll be thankful if God grants me one more day on this spectacular planet. And I'll be back tomorrow morning where perhaps we can all be thankful for another cowboy win. Today's episode has been brought to you by Fluent Financial, by O'Hell Roofing, and by Goodness Steak Seasoning. Thank you for listening to today's episode of Just Wondering. If you enjoyed it, please hit follow. And then each episode every weekday will be delivered straight to you. And if we might ask one more favor, please share it with friends. I'm Norm Hitzkes, and every day, I'll be just wondering about something. And I'm Mary Hitchkiss, and I'm just wondering, too. Just Wondering is a production of DSP Media for FanStream Sports. You can find Norm's show along with other great programming at fanstreamsports.com.